Final Fantasy IX is one of my all-time favorite games, from the aesthetic to the music to this guy. Yet, as with all games, not even Final Fantasy IX is without its own glitches and exploits. One of the more famous ones is the Cotton Robe trick. While not a glitch by itself, it is an exploit that allows the player to acquire all the money! To do the Cotton Robe trick, you need any equal amount of the item steepled hat and wrist. These are really easy to find in shops throughout most of the game. The steeple hat can be bought in Limblum and Summit Station on discs 1 and 2, in the Black Mage Village on discs 2 and 3, and at the Little Save Moogle way in the back of Vermesha's dungeon on all four discs. This last one is the only place you can get the steepled hat on disc 4, so by that point it's your only real option. Wrist is easier. You can buy it in Dolly. Thankfully, Dolly is accessible on every disc, so this exploit can be used throughout the game. Now how do you do this devious hand wringing the evil way to consolidate all the wealth of Gaia into your scheming pockets? After buying an equal amount of wrists and steeple hats, head to any synthesis shop and craft as many cotton robes as you can. Then, sell those. Boom. Profit. Okay, let's break it down. A wrist costs 130 gil, a steeple hat is 260, and a cotton robe costs 1000 gil to synthesize. That's a total cost of 1390 gil. Selling those cotton robes gets you 2000 gil apiece, giving you a net profit of 610 gil per cotton robe sold. This doesn't seem like a lot, until it adds up. If you do the trick with 99 wrists and 99 steeple hats, the max the game allows, then sell the 99 cotton robes, that's a profit of 60,390 gil per trip. Now with your newfound wealth, you can buy all the glacial pickles and Southgate bunk cake you want. And with that, we've covered yet another video game exploit. My name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and this has been Glitches and Secrets. See you all in the next video.